Hello, friends. Today's activity is putting puzzles together. Now, uh, this is a great activity for your child to start to understand shapes. And I don't know if you remember um, when we were kids, the balls that were plastic and you, and it was like you put the shapes in the right hole. And that was a great way for us to learn shapes. Well, puzzles are another great way for your child to learn shapes. So maybe they're not ready for a big puzzle yet. Something easy that you can do is take um, a picture, maybe an old um, greeting card that you have, or a picture from a magazine that you can um, cut out into different shapes, and they could be simple shapes. For example, just cut out like circles and a triangle and a rectangle and a square. Start simple and have the child find the right shape that goes in that space, okay? Then when they are ready, when they've mastered, you know, finding the shapes, then you can try um, a little bit harder where you make it, um, you know, like a puzzle piece where it has the part that comes out or the part that goes in, you can try those. And you can get um, simple puzzles. Um, I know Doug and Melissa are good with the wooden puzzles that are really easy for kids to manipulate because they're thick and um, they enjoy putting those together. Um, so that's a great way. Um, you can still, again, use magazines or old pictures that you have and just cut them out in different shapes and have them, you know, have a have one for them to look at and then um, have them try to put the pieces together and just encourage them and say, oh, this looks like the rabbit's ear. What do you think we need to look for on the puzzle? And they would say the other part of the rabbit's ear or the other rabbit's ear, um, something like that. Okay, um, just to get them to use their their um, use the clues that um, on the piece and try to match it to the puzzle and it's and it's important to have one for them to look at so they can kind of gauge where it goes okay um let's see so like i said start off easy and then gradually move up um as they are more confident with um, putting pieces together and independent putting pieces together. Um, I find puzzles myself very rewarding. Um, it's a great sense of accomplishment when you're able to put a puzzle together. Um, and it's great for their brain. Um, it's a great um, tool, just that problem solving and trying to turn pieces and move them and try them in different places. It's just really great for their brain. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.